Good morning, everyone. Hi, YouTubers. Um, this is Pots, Pans, and Pioneers this morning. Um, I've not put up a video this week yet. Um, we have an enormous amount of rain still. Um, there's a storm or tropical depression that's hit Dallas and haven't been able to do much with the garden. Um, I think most of it is a bust and we are drawing up or trying to come up with some plans for a um, a greenhouse so that we can prevent uh, rains and you know stringent heat from destroying our garden. Um, my tomatoes are hanging in there. Um, I just haven't been able to get out and record just due to the weather and I've repotted and remixed things. Um, everything is just getting drenched so I've been unable to really give anybody an update um, but I wanted to let you know that um, I will record when there's something really to record and when there's some progress. Um, I told my husband I'm not really sure what the pioneers did. Um, they must have had to do an enormous amount of planning because the seasons weren't always perfect. You know, they they weren't they weren't always you know bright and sunny and you know perfect for for producing food. And so um, this is the first year that I've really put 100% of effort into creating my own garden and doing my own food with the exception of some really small containers. Um, I don't trust what's in the soil uh, where I live, so I've been done everything with organic soil. So um, we're going to do some better planning, um, to say the least, but I'm hoping that with some more research and some more plans that we're going to have as beautiful garden as I see on people that I'm watching on YouTube and keeping up with their gardens. So it's not for the lack of effort. It's um, truly been a, just a horrible rain season here. Um, and we've had seven years of real dry drought. So this is really kind of unexpected. Anyway, I wanted to give you that uh, update and um, I've got some people emailing me asking me if there's going to be a garden update and I just wanted to let everybody know uh, it's not for the lack of effort or time or that nothing nothing's really producing right now because it's just getting so much rain and it may be a loss I don't know um, I've been told that first year gardening is a struggle for everybody and I'm learning that um, I've done gardening in the past, just not to this level, not trying to produce uh, enough food for canning and freezing and that type of thing. So um, I am going to be recording uh, our story video, which is going to give you a little background on my husband and I, what we do, um, how we earn an income, and where we're going to be going in the future because we're going to be making some pretty major changes within the next 12 to 24 months. And we would like to take you on that journey. We'd also want to journal this truly. My main purpose is journaling this for my my kids uh, and their children to see what happened with, you know, grandma and grandpa as, you know, they decided to move on into the last phase of their life. So um, I hope you'll stick around. Don't get discouraged about watching the gardening. Um, especially for my channel. There's so many gardening YouTube videos out there. Um, but I'm just gaining a lot, a lot of information and I'm just trying to do my best to produce, you know, at least 30 to 35 percent of what we eat. So um, anyway, I hope you stay tuned. Um, if you are looking for recipes or, you know, blog information on great cleaning supplies or gardening tips, or that type of thing. I do share a lot of that information on my Facebook page and you can also go to potspansandpioneers.com. Um, we're also on Instagram and I'm going to be uh, looking into some other avenues for social media so that you can have the direct interaction. Something different that everybody on YouTube is truly not doing. So um, 
stay tuned. We've got a lot of stuff coming, and um, I'm going to be having some summer treat video recipes um, probably Friday. Um, this has been a Father's Day week of an enormous amount of work for us, um, if you can see behind me over there. Uh, we have uh, several heat presses and a DTG machine. I run a t-shirt shop, but I'll tell you more about that in another video. But um, we've had a lot of success for Father's Day, and so I've just been really busy designing, printing, and shipping items to all of our thousands of customers that just keep buying from us, and we love them. Anyway, I will talk to y'all later. Have a great week, and God bless you.